They were here to break down O'Neill Cruz's 2022 season. He is quite the polarizing player among the fantasy community. He finished his rookie season in the majors with 17 home runs and 11 stolen bases in 361 plate appearances, while also having nine home runs and 11 stolen bases in 247 AAA plate appearances. Cruz did struggle to make contact, however, posting a 66.2% contact rate and a 49% ground ball rate, and he struck out nearly 35% of the time in the majors. Calls for concern. Stackhouse data, however, is off the charts. He had the hardest hit ball in Statcast history at 122.4 miles an hour. He posted a 90th percentile EV of 111.4 miles an hour, which ranked just behind Aaron Judge's 111.16. The six foot seven monster also can move pretty quickly. He had a 98th percentile sprint speed, which ranked at the top of baseball, obviously, 29.9 feet per second. That's a huge encouragement. The power speed is what makes him so interesting. The plate discipline is the concern. But when we look at this rolling graph here, we do see some improvements throughout the year. The zone contact rate improved. His ground ball rate turned it downward. That was at a rolling percent of about 60% between games 25 and 60. That's pretty significant and a huge improvement towards the end of the season there. You look at the rest of the profile, he chased less often and he struck out less as the season ended. All positive signs moving forward. Swings Graphs had an interesting tweet yesterday that I noticed about his improved vertical bat angle and attack angle. I went to the film to look at this. Vertical bat angle is basically the difference in where the knob of the bat is and where the barrel of the bat is. It varies based on where the pitch is in the zone, but here's an example of Cruz going down and getting a pitch off Corbin Burns and also him getting one up in the zone, and he has a good bat angle at both of these. I think that with the improvements that we saw down the stretch, that Cruz is going to have a big year. From September 1st on, he finished with a 288 average, a 359 OBP, and a 529 slug. Sub 30% K rate, six home runs, five stolen bases. I'm buying big time in Dynasty and in 2023.